Congratulations on the last couple of years. You have been killing it. And Mary and George is fantastic. We got to see the pilot episode already, and we're obsessed and cannot wait for more. You see more. It, it certainly evolves uh, from episode to episode. Now, I want to ask you, because normally this kind of story is gender flock. We all know like Anne Boleyn, women who kind of use their sexuality to move their way to the top. And this is a woman, a man doing the same. And I want to ask you why you wanted to do this and what kind of research you did to kind of get into this role. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I wanted to do it because um, it was one of the most interesting scripts, uh, well-written scripts I'd read. And then finding out a lot of this history was you know, entirely true, um, kind of um, floored me. I mean, this is a young man who, whose family was, you know, on, on the potential, uh, the verge of, of oblivion in a lot of ways. And the fact that he rose to essentially become the King of England during the Jacobean era is, is astounding. And um, yeah, I mean, he, he's such a wonderfully textured character. And obviously this is historical fiction and we, we brought some of our own perspectives to, to the story, but um, I mean, he was probably, probably my favorite character I've ever played. Yeah. My last thing is, how many earrings did you steal? Oh my God, so many. I, I don't know if I have the boldness yet to, to, to wear... A pearl earring is a statement on a day-to-day -day basis, and, it, and, and they're, they're heavy as well, you know, so I don't want to be weighed down. Um, but uh, no, uh, yeah, George's, George's thing is the pearl earring. We're trying to make it a, a fashion statement, so uh, yeah. Thank you so much, and congratulations.